what is going on guys it's your boy mr random back at you guys with another video and today i have something a very very special for you guys how many times haven't you been watching your favorite car youtubers channel for example that dude in blue tj hunt Muscle versus Tuner, Adam LZ, Vehicle Virgins, and you've wondered, man, wouldn't it be awesome if these guys got together one day and they just raced their famous cars against each other? Well, you know what? I had that same thought and I decided to put that to the test. That's right. This series is going to be called YouTubers versus YouTubers. We're going to take our favorite YouTubers cars and we're going to put them against each other. I'm going to be using Forza 6 because it's the best car simulator that you can get on a console. And we're going to try our very best to replicate our favorite YouTubers cars using their, uh, their YouTube channels, their Instagram, all the info we can gather to make the most accurate virtual portrayal of their cars that we can. And today we're doing two of the greatest. That dude in blue's Smurfstang versus TJ Hunt's miley brz make sure you guys stay tuned for more episodes also leave your uh, your comments below with any suggestions or any youtubers that you might want to see go head to head and i will try my best to replicate that guys let's get right into it all right guys now first up we have uh that dude in blues ford mustang 5.0 now i know a lot of you guys are saying hey wait a minute that's not a 5.0 that's a mustang cobra i am well aware of that however forza 6 for some weird reason does not feature the 5.0 mustang so unfortunately we have to make do with the best that we have and that is the shelby gt 500 the 2013 shelby gt 500 which is pretty much the same platform that david's 5.0 is based off of now, if a lot of you guys have paid attention to his videos, his uh, Mustang, his Smurf thing, currently has about 630 horsepower. Okay, now the lowest horsepower we can get for this GT500 is 662. All right, guys. I just uh, removed all the decals from it. I tried getting the exact rims that he has, the exact color. I uh, debadged it. Well, I tried my best to debadge it. Um, so this is, as it sits, this is as close as we can get to David's car, a.k.a. that dude in blue. And here we have TJ Hunt's red Subaru BRZ, a.k.a. Miley. Now, this is pretty much as close as we can get with the Forza 6 editor to give that kind of uh, that wide body look that he has. Look at that. It even says Hunt and Co. on the side. We got the blacked out spoiler where it says Twerk It Miley. They even got the license plate right in the back. Okay, now I know the rims are off and I know the front lips, uh, lip is wrong as well. But like I said, this is Forza 6. We're trying to just get as close as we can. Um, now, if you notice the first Mustang, it, uh, it has about 30 horsepower more than the real life counterpart. So to balance that out, we gave Miley an extra 30 horsepower bringing its real life counterpart from 340 to 371. And we got that dude in blue's car from 630 to 660. So we should be right back to square one when it comes to being a pretty much to the real world counterpart guys. So without further ado, let's get this going. All right guys, this is the moment of truth. It's gonna be that dude in blue's car versus tj hunt now a lot of you guys are probably saying wait a minute that's not that's not the mustang that you had showed us earlier it looks completely different the color is different it has striping well there's a problem with forza the geniuses at forza 6 decided that your guests cannot use your garage cars they can't use your custom cars in your garage even though you can do that in forza 5 i'm sorry in forza 4 which is like thirty thousand years old but apparently the idiots at forza 6 couldn't figure out how to do that so the only difference right now between that Mustang and the one that I had showed you guys earlier is that the paint is different. Now, when I do the track test, which is going to be uh, single only, that's going to be the actual Mustang that I uh, edited to look just like that dude in blues. So pretty much we still got the same horsepower on both. Everything's pretty much the same, except the color scheme is different on the Mustang. OK, so we're going to check out on this uh, drag race on on your go. Uh, so you're going to count to three, two, one. On your go, we go. Three, two, one, go. 
I've got that head start, really light BRZ, all that horsepower, and as expected, the Mustang pulls way ahead. Not by that much, I mean, obviously a big significant difference, but you know what, the BRZ has a good little launch. It had a good, uh, a good start, man, not bad for a small car. Now let's go take both of these to the track and let's see who completes the track faster because it's not always about going in a straight line. All right, we have first up is going to be that dude in blues, Smurfstang. Let's get it started. All right, guys, I'm going to need a focus so I can't talk too much. As you guys can see, though, I did say that it was going to be as close as we can get to it, uh, to his actual Mustang. So here we go. One, go. Come on, Smurfstang. hit that corner really good. Surprise. I try to kill this as fast as I can, guys. Mustangs aren't the best at cornering, and we all know that. They're big, they're powerful, they're heavy. They're good at straight lines, but they're not good at corners. very normal. Alright, we're at the halfway point in this track so far. I think we're doing a good time. In the Smurf Stang. stretch Nine point seven six six. Can TJ's car beat that? Well, I guess we're just gonna have to find out. And we have Miley showing up to the scene, guys. Can she beat the Smurf Stang? Can TJ's car beat uh, that dude in blue's car in the track? It lost in the in the drag race. So that was expected, of course. But can it do what it was meant to do in the track? Let's find out, guys. Twerk it, Miley. Two, one, go. Man, this thing has a good start, man. You know what they say sometimes, slow and steady wins the race. Look at that, man. Corner's like a champ. Barely any brakes. I think we might just beat that Mustang's out of time. 209 is a time to beat. Can we do it? Can Miley do it? A little bit of oversteer there. Damn, this thing corner's crazy, man. You see, it's not always about who can go the fastest in a straight line. Sometimes it takes a little bit of finesse. This thing handles the corners like a beast. Look at that time, we're already at the halfway point. All 
there we go. Now you might be wondering why I'm so quiet, it's because I'm trying to focus. This is a, a big thing that a lot of people have debated for a lot of years, and I'm trying to settle it once and for all. Whose car reigns supreme? I'll tell you what, I got a lot more respect for the BRZ now. I see why it's so popular, why so many people buy this thing. Can we do it, guys? Can we do it? No! Wait! 210! Damn it! So close! By one second. Miley lost. That dude in blue's car won by one second in the track. I could have probably driven a little harder, but overall, drag race, track, Smurf Stang reigns supreme, guys. I'll see you guys for the next episode. Take it easy.